back once again with the long haul episode 35 of seven days console version well the legacy version and well i've been just working at the bank here overnight just working to get this all collapsed uh you can see that i cleared out basically the whole interior aside from like lights that's a little bit too high but um oh hi curly looks like curly's one to come over and inspect my work He's a big boy, but I appreciate you wanting to come over, sir, but we are not taking applications right now. I'm having to take out all the safes and everything like that, just uh, mine this all out and, you know, just to get it collapsed. I was thinking maybe I could get it done by morning, but, and I realized, and I had to undermine the, the bank vault itself. Just to uh, not not deal with the uh, all the concrete, because uh, I realize I'm like, oh, how long is this gonna take? It's six thousand hit points. So it's like I had to go through nine thousand hit points total of reinforced concrete just to per block, just to break out the bottom layer that one block, and so it's gonna take a long time get through that so I, just, I looked at the floor and it was only like 500 hit points so I figured screw it we're gonna go through and we're gonna we're gonna go and uh, just undermine the floor and uh, I think hopefully probably for the the last little bit of the like for the initial collapsing uh, we will do the we will do the old uh, we'll do the bank vault door uh, as our collapsing point so because the physics on this version are a little bit weird when it comes to collapsing, and it's a... It, it it can be strange to say the least. But, um, I'm going to continue breaking down blocks here, and I think I'm actually going to... I might actually time-lapse it for you until I'm ready to, ready to, bring, the, to bring the bank down, so let the time-lapse commence. Oh, YouTube, the the building has started to come down. Uh, I broke this a little area out. <laughs> Let's just have a little watch of the collapse here. I was, ex I was, with how the physics of this game can be, it it likes to kind of have like what we call, what I like to call POI glue, where it likes to just kind of be this weird uh, where it likes to stay up like it's especially happens with the uh, logger POI sorry don't mean to look away but yeah you can see this beautiful collapse here and uh, I was just saying how uh, how I will have to clean up the the remnants of this and, wait a minute well it hasn't completely collapsed yet so I, I haven't gotten all of it done I still have this little area to do, and, and you know, I have these supports to knock out and all of these walls. And keep in mind, I'm doing this for the sake of, uh, you know, trying to keep the, uh, the zombies, uh, from getting caught up on the bank uh, like I did with my first Fortnite. Um, yep, a couple more collapse and, you know, blocks, but, um... Yeah, I'll uh, I'll proceed to uh, tune in with you once uh, more blocks uh, come down and uh, yo know, once uh, once you do all this. So be with be with you once more collapses happen. Well, YouTube, it's been uh, a little while. You know, probably gonna be a lot of time lapsing, but um. We got one more block to break out, I believe. 
I'm hoping this is the last block to break out for the bank. And then we can finally see Larissa's collapse. What do you mean? What is this... What is this thing being held up by? Oh, really? What, what is this being held up by? Oh, please, game. Don't tell me that. Don't tell me this. I want this to be broken. Tell me it's like a... I'm like, what is this? This is the testament to seven days of jank. What do you mean? What do you mean this is a... I almost wanna... Hang on. I'm gonna go... I'm gonna go put some stuff back in the... In my house really quick. Cause th this is a little... This is a little annoying. Throw out the plant fibers. Th this is... Come on, seven days. This is a little ridiculous in terms of <laughs> seven days jank. I've seen some jank. Watched a lot of seven days videos on it, but it's like I have seen a lot of seven days jank over the years. This is a little ridiculous. I don't mean to come off as ranting or raving, it's just that I'm like, what is this seven days that I jank? This is a little ridiculous, I, I believe. I just want to put some stuff back. And while I'm at it, I'm going to grab my level 600 pickaxe. I'm just like, what is this jank? I really don't understand this. I was hoping... I was hoping this would just be... The game just going away and, well, you know, just admitting defeat and... Because realistically, okay, you're seeing all this, like, this realistically should not even be, should not even be standing. Even by seven days terms. Let me try breaking this out. A couple. I, uh, my mind is just, my mind's just having a, having, having spaghetti thoughts here. I'm like, what? What is this? What is this? Frickin' seven days jank. What is holding this place up? I was hoping this would collapse. <clears throat> Causing it to... be a... Let me try... punching out some of the glass and... and breaking this out, because that should do it. It's not even that big of a POI. I don't even know what the deal is with it. Come on, you. Start. I want you to start breaking. I've... i come this far to... take you out and... just for you to... to pull seven days on me. This is ridiculous, as seven days. Oh! There... Uh Yeah. Yeah, this this makes sense seven days. Yep. I don't even know what's going on here. <laughs> like I'm being totally honest. This is not me pulling some magic or some witchcraft or you know, something like this. This is just Seven Days being a being the glitchy game that it is. Um, I apologize, guys. I was hoping this would actually collapse. But no. The game proceeds to give me this... The game proceeds to give me this... Uh, give me this uh, Hocus Pocus kind of nonsense and well it <sighs> ah, seven days you you pain the butt see that collapses uh, it's like I'm wondering if I just start building out like a you 
you can kind of see it. it's like the games is kind of noping out on physics a little bit. Um. Uh, um. Yeah. Welcome to the 70s, folks. Where the where the land of uh, of Jank is uh, home. Uh Yeah, give me a little bit, YouTube. Uh, I'll try to figure out this this weirdness. What about if we try to collapse it like that? Up. Hang on, we might be on to something. Um, YouTube, I think I might have figured this out. Nope. I was going to say, I think I might have figured this out. With seven days being... Being a... Being weird, but... My theory is... Try to pull out all the sports from it and... And then, uh... You know, just try to... Give it a... Try to give it a... You know, just try to yank the sports out. And, uh... Because th this is just so weird. Uh... Oops, I for completely forgot to. Yeah, no. <laughs> yeah, let's see if we can at least try to get the rest of this building collapsed, because this is just. I want to just try to do this, see if we can. What is with this? Um. Yeah. Let's try yanking the sport out of it. Oh, there's some collapsing. Let's see how much this collapses. See if it's actually enough to take out the take out the bank. If that was all, thank goodness. I was getting later in the day, but. Yep. I was say, is that gonna break? That's. Yeah, I think that broke. That finally brought down the. The last of the bank. There we go, YouTube. Finally. Was well, one to achieve. Ah. Uh, ah. Uh. Well, let's actually break this block out, too. There we go. Finally, the. Uh, finally, the. The bank has uh, been collapsed, and I could finally rest easy with it. Well, I actually sprained my leg uh, during that activity, so... Well, I'm going to go back in to my base here, and I'm going to actually grab a splint, and I'm going to start cleaning up YouTube, and I will let you know once it's Horde night. YouTube is almost time for the Horde. Oh. We'll just shot that out. It is... As you can see, I destroyed all the... All that... Junk over at the bank. It's completely flattened. I'll just do a little preparation here, yo. Hopefully the horde base actually... Works out this time and... Uh, does, uh, does itself good. As long as zombies don't get... Uh, don't get too... Focus here. Hello. Bye bye. I'm hoping they don't be on the ramp too much. They shouldn't. They should have plenty of things to do. So there we go. Bob's gone. We got Mikey. Hi. Oh, Marla's got a little bit more of a reach. Oh, it's a crawler. Oh, I did not realize the crawlers could get through here. Oh, that's a slight oversight by me. I mean, if only if it's only crawlers, then that's perfectly fine. 
Come here, crawler. Oh, that's good to know. No, wait, that's Psycho Steve. Huh. Oh, see you later, Psycho Steve. There we go. There you go. Oh, sounds like they're beating on something. Sounds like they're having a little bit of a time. Let's just go check up, up top, shall we? Oh, that's just Bob. Ah! Nope, nope, no, nope. Get off me. Ow. Well, that, this is a mistake. Well. I completely screwed up on that. Oh, great. Great, now I gotta do zombie run with a, with a sprained leg. Oh. Get away from me, Bob. Get away from me. I don't have the mini bike out. Outside of base. Joy. <laughs> well, I actually messed up on this. That. I was going to check to see the damage from the zombies, and. Well. We got a little bit of. I got a little bit of a pickle. I was not expecting this. Oh, great. I gotta find some. Gotta find some wood to try and at least have a little try and at least survive a little bit come on I'm not talking about a splint I'm talking about trying to grab a try to grab a, some wood frames so yeah oh this one really awry here folks and oh, we got some crawlers um, I gotta try and nerve pull my way up to the, up to the base again, just to get up. Gray, they're, they're trying to get up, so, well, they're trying to break into the, there we go, try and nerd, nerd pull a little bit, get up on the frame. Oh, that, <laughs> that almost turned dicey. I really need to figure out a new uh, entrance because the mini bike entrance is good, but not so much if I don't have a don't have a don't have an entrance on on foot that I could do. That's my fault though. Back to it. Seems like this this design's gonna do pretty well. Just gonna be a bit of a problem for crawlers, but. Hey, that's why I have hatches here. That way they can't squeeze through. I funny thing is I don't know how they Oh wait, they probably tripped on cacti. That's probably why. Yeah, see you later, Nancy. Um I wish the zombies would not not beat on the old uh be on the old <laughs> ramp, but hey, now I know for now I know for next time. Um, uh, Mikey, hello, hello, hello. Would you... I would find it hilarious if I, I... Ironically enough, me had... Cacti... Cacti, uh, be... The most effective thing. Oh! Nancy's gone. Um, Crawler wants to have a word. Let's try to take care of you. There you go. Everybody gets a, gets a piece of this. Uh, Mikey, 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 Mikey. Can you make up your mind for once, please? Thank you. There we go. Mikey finally can make up his mind. See, this this allows me to take uh take the blunderbuss to him. Yo, when they're standing, at least. These were from next word night, I might have to go go check on the uh Well go do a cacti sweep. You're you're done for I might even put spikes just to uh keep keep uh decentivize uh zombies. So we'll try to take out zombies with uh with them. Uh, okay. Lots of crawlers. Living in the plains biome has its advantages. You basically get free spike traps in the form of cacti. They take out zombie legs for whatever reason. 
There you go. Ah, try to take care of him. Mikey's gone. Um, Charlie, 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 buddy. I know you. I know you can't make up your mind sometimes, but you could. You can at least do me a favor and just calm down. Seems like with the zombie bodies of the crawlers, crawlers have you can't get out, which is nice. So, um, sir, I would really appreciate you not beating on that. Not a perfect design, but hey, it's a it's a design nonetheless. At least I'm trying to. I, I'm sure somebody's done this kind of base before with this uh, design, but to me, it's about trying to kind of be stretch out from the norm a little bit. Oh, Bob, come here. Come here. I'll even give you a little bit of sniper rifle for your for your troubles. There you go, good boy. There you. Go. Yeah, that's this is why I have hatches. It's like just to keep me outside of uh, zombie reach. Now, okay, let's try this once again. Not break my leg. Um, Bob's just Bob's brother are hanging out over there. Just try to snipe him at least. I figured there might be a little bit of... I was kind of planning for... Oh, talk, took, I think I just took him out. Oh! Sorry about that, Charlie. I forgot about that frame. <laughs> well, silly me. There you go. Take a headshot. Take a headshot and... Oh, Mikey used the ramp. Now he's done. Uh, crawlers are there. And... Well... I think I just took out Penny. Let's try to... Yeah, you can see there's a couple more over here. Okay. Maybe it wouldn't be a bad idea to have... Well, then again, I'm gonna have, like, a catwalk. A catwalk hanging out on the, uh, the old, uh, uh, where it allows me to kind of give this firepower on this side. I just want to try to take out these, uh, stragglers. Nope! Oh, nurse! She's really quick. Don't know why you guys need to go over there. Sounds like you got a dog, but... Curly's gone. Mikey's down. Yeah, you can see it's not it's not too bad. Could could just use a little bit of improvements. Oh, dog. Yeah, thankfully the poles keep uh, keep dogs out though. The nurse is there. We got Marlo. Hello. Much happy to oblige you. We got. We got Party Crawler. Now he's gone. Nurse is back. Oh! Stay off the wood frames, please. Get off me. Get off me. Yeah, I know shocking will do a little bit of damage, but... Oh well. I th I'm thinking, though, for a... For a later, like, kind of like later when I have uh, more, like a better, a later iteration of the, of the Horde base, uh, to, to get the old, uh... Ow, I think the dog hit me. Maybe it was Curly, I don't know, but, uh... On this side, and then like on the other side, I'll have like little apron, you know, maybe like little aprons, uh, keeping uh, keeping zombies at bay. Well, like you know, just for 
providing firepower you know, with all this. It's like, this base is not nearly finished. I need, like, I... I know it's like, it may seem crazy to me to say that, but it's like, I still have a whole other half, but it's like, some of these problems will be... Ow! Psycho Steve, get off me. Hi, Chris. Hi, Chris. But it's just kind of like, yo... Like, we'll see this base evolve as time goes on, and... You know, it's like, some of these problems should iron themselves out, so... There's a Marla gun. But what I like is I'm actually still getting use out of the old uh, blunderbuss here. This, some people might say it's uh, not very good, you know, because it's a single shot, but for a base like this, if you can keep zombies just from uh, being, you know, doing, uh, from hitting you, it's like, you know, with these iron bars, you can, you can do a lot with the blunderbuss. It's just like, it's just not really that efficient. But sometimes you just want good old fashioned fun. Oh, there's a crawler. Hi. Bye. Yeah, you can see it's like, you know, sometimes it's just good to have some good old fashioned fun. Uh, alright. Let's do a little bit more checking on the zombies on the outside of the base. I will probably put out guardrails just to have have a little bit of a, uh, keep me from flying off the side of the base like that. And you're done. You moved a little bit too much, but you can see it's like this, I mean, like I say, I'll probably put wood spikes just as like a, maybe line the, uh, line the area with a little bit of a, you know, like some wood log spikes and then spikes on top, you know, just to have a, have a little bit of a, have a little bit of a, uh, you know, extra protection. Kyle I'm not even really mad about this. It's like, it's just, to me, it's a, it's kind of like, let's, it's kind of a, okay, what went wrong? Okay, and then, like, yo, let's improve this for the next ward. I like experimenting like this. Oh, let's not, let's not drop into zombies and re-break my leg. But yeah, you... Kind of those with this, you know... I keep forgetting that, you know, this, this version of the game's gonna be the legacy. You can see there. That, I managed to clear that all out. It's like, made sure there was no debris left on it. No zombies on that side. Another crawler. We'll have to go check out the damage over there. Just to see how it's like. But it's just like... Um... Yeah, you know, this game's gonna... This game's interesting in its own right. Bye, dog. We only got about an hour left before Horde Knight's over with. Fire off last these blunderbuss rounds. Oh! Hi! How'd you get... Uh... Uh... I don't know what happened there. How are you getting... Wait a minute. How are these guys getting through... They're walking right through my... My bars. They're not even broken, mind you. I'm just like, what is that all about? That, I have never seen that happen before. Um, uh, the zombies suddenly decide that they got uh, telepathic capabilities? Because I've seen that. Okay, the only time I think I've seen that happen before is like when the zombies, like, on the day 14 horde. But I'm like, how did you... How are you phasing through this like it's nothing? That's... That's a mystery. Maybe somebody can explain to me in the comments, but... Level 110. 
Uh, we got about 15 minutes to hoard. We got Nancy. Come on over. Bye, Nancy. We got Curly. He's one to have a word. Oh, bye, uh, Psycho Steve. Come here. Where are you going? Go, uh, go away. We'll just pop you the sniper. Ooh, that that's a that's a little bit, that's a shot. But like I say, we'll go we'll go check up on the go check up on the horde. You know, we'll go check up on the damage. We got five minutes here, so pop you. Nancy's gone. Um, I think we're safe to go out. It's basically some morning time. Speak of the bell. All right, let's go check. I know I'm still infected, but not worried about that at the moment. I got plenty of medications for it. Let's go take a look. Um, taking a look at the ramp. They didn't really break out too much of the that. That's and that's why I reinforced it. You know, at least with a gave it enough reinforcements to have. Uh, they broke out one of the wedge tips. That's okay. Um, yeah, no, they were just kind of running at it. Yeah, as you can see, it's like you know, survived the horde. You know, had a couple close calls, but with like the zombie phasing through, it's a little unusual. But uh, yo, know, hey, there's like no deaths this time, unlike the two deaths from last time. So, a couple dogs, yo. Know. Come here, Annie. Come on. Ah, there you go. So yeah, I think that's going to be about it for today's episode, guys. Uh, if you made it this far and enjoyed, I hope you like, uh, comment, subscribe, and I hope you take care. Have a great day.